Hi Sunshines, welcome back to our channel. I'm Taylor Ann. And I'm Lori Ann. And, and together, together we are Mad Curls. I forgot to tell you that before we got on. I know. remember. But I oh remember. my god, so cool. <laughs> Alright, the light bulb is on early this morning. Now we know our intro. I think we we're there. Hopefully. I think we're there. Alright, just not have too much confidence in that. Alright, yeah. next video will bust it. I know, okay. Okay guys, so welcome back to another Mad Curls video. Mm -hmm. We said this one today is going to be like super casual. Because like we had to do a video and we weren't really sure what we want to do. We need to get our lives organized. Yes. Because we're going to Miami next week and so mm -hmm. we're just kind of like focusing on that trying to like get our stuff together and whatnot so like we didn't yeah. really have a video planned we were like thanks to you guys we're going just thanks yeah you guys. <laughs> so we were like you know what let's just give them a wash and go let's mm -hmm. just do something and say hello yeah yeah so i'm doing something new and you're doing something borrowed and something blue right <laughs> <laughs> yeah. i'm just trying to figure out the different combinations to see if there's any truth which i believe that there is because i had the experience with we're talking about the brand of curl mix and i had the experience with the different oils so the one that they put out that was unscented to me made my hair feel slightly drier then i saw the other day on instagram somebody asked me was it clean beauty curls which, which clean there is a clean beauty curls on instagram okay so probably i watched her growth journey so her hair is probably about shoulder and she loves curl now. mix Okay, so yeah, probably. probably so she was saying that the rose one she wasn't really as fond of that scent as she is of the lavender one. So, um, but how many days do I get out of each one? And so I'm just kind of like trying to mix it up because I ran out of the moisturizer for the for this um, the softening one, which is the green one, and I still have the moisturizer for the lavender one. So I'm gonna use this first and then put this over top of it because this will moisturize my hair and this will soften it. So yeah. we'll see. So we're just playing around, just stopping by to visit. And I want to try something new. So I've been kind of having this set sitting here for a while. It was sent to us from uh, Urban Hydration. We have never done Urban Hydration on our channel, but it actually it came in this box right here. It was like their gift set, but it's their honey line. On their website, it says um, honey growth and repair. This says honey health and repair. I th I'm pretty sure they're the same product. They just changed the name. I think growth and repair sounds a little bit like, you know, Ooh, hair growth. That's yeah. kind of more exciting than health and repair. Yeah. Like, I don't know. So I think they changed the name, but anyway, there's four products that come in this little kit here. So if I already used two of them, I'm going to use the stylers and I don't know. I'm just playing around. They smell amazing. So okay. I'm playing around with urban hydration. Has anyone them tried urban hydration to the channel? This is our first time. <laughs> so that's what's going down. Yep. So we are going to chit chat, do our hair, the usual. The usual. So if you want to see that, hang out with us for a little bit, then please keep watching. Please keep watching. Okay. So first things first, water. water. I was going to get my other water bottle today, the big one that really has a lot of um, water releasing properties when I spray. Which one but is that, the black one? It's, it might be the black one. I, I know I couldn't find it. It's like a taller bottle and it really almost kind of like it does Wait, double time. Wait, is that time. the one in the, on the bathroom with the apple cider vinegar in it? I, don't, I hope not. It, it might be. I don't know. There's one on the floor that's been there forever and it has right. the apple cider vinegar in it. It does. It, maybe that's where it was at because I couldn't find it this it's probably morning. probably ruined now. Mm, yeah, so I'll have to get another one. Yeah. But I like that one. It's kind of like the ones the salon, the stylist used in the salons because it does like double time. You squirt down. So this is cute. This was like all the rage when this first came out and everybody wanted it. We got more questions about where did we get it? Where did we get it? Now just about everybody has it, I think. So um, so now I have to move on to newer and better things now. <laughs> Bigger and better things. Bigger and better. So if you guys saw the video the other day with me and Tay and the the mad bros, as you call them. But the Spencer, mad bro, Spencer's mad like, like the bro type. So, um, I said, brother. but he's a brother. So I said, cause I know bro is short for brother. Yeah. So I said, I call them the mad brothers because Spencer doesn't look like a mad bro. He doesn't, he doesn't kind of like, <laughs> he's too uptight. He's too uptight to, to be, be a bro. To be like a bro. Right. So he has to be a brother. So I said the mad brothers. The mad but brothers. anywho. The mad, whatever they are. Whatever. Whoever they, they are. Whoever they are. Adam using less proper, um, product. That, I kind of dug that. Though. I have to be honest and say it didn't hold as well that the video it turned out fabulous but by the by, end of the night by the end of the night okay um it was just kind of like starting to poof out for no reason though i do touch my hair a lot so i have yeah. to say that but um i don't know then by the next morning which was what was it yesterday and then today no i don't know No, we left we left our hair basically for two days i think okay so but this morning you were like girl girl yeah no girl <laughs> girl you're here this morning. I was just like, please dunk it in water immediately. Do not wait. Do not pass go. Do not cut 200. Just water. One thing I'm not doing is just keep patting my head like Adam. Like, what was that about, guys? No. I just kept patting and patting and patting. Like, All right. get some product in here. 
So in this kit, there was a shampoo and a deep conditioner. So I shampooed my hair with the shampoo and it was decent. I liked it, smelled good. It did what a shampoo um, did. Am I jumping out the window? Not really, but it was it was nice. It's part of the little kit. So I shampooed my hair with this. It was a nice shampoo. And then I use the deep conditioner. I left it in, I would say for maybe about 20, 30 minutes and then I rinsed it out. There is no protein in this, even though I saw like health and repair and like, I was going to leave it in while we did our makeup and whatever, but just the repair word made me nervous. Yeah. And I don't see protein in the ingredients, but sometimes we're not good at reading ingredients. So I wasn't sure. And I'm like, I was not in the mood to play around right, okay. with protein and I have protein overload. So I just rinsed it out <laughs> and my hair felt nice. My curls were nice. Um, it's a nice deep conditioner. Okay. So the stylers in here are the daily moisturizer, which you can kind of use as a leave-in if you want to, or you can just go right in with their styling cream. I think I'm going to put a little bit of the moisturizer down first, then do the styling cream. And that's what's going down. All right. Over really here. Cool. What did you shampoo your hair I with? I shampooed my hair with the shampoo conditioner to curl mix. This is thick. To see. It's actually um, thick. <laughs> oh, snap. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, so because you absolutely rave about it. I used it when it first came out. And you constantly rave about it. I love the conditioner. The shampoo is um, a shampoo. You know, I mean, there's there's so many out there on the market, but I'm I'm finding even though I've often said, you know, you don't have to like buy the whole set and collections of things. It's just not necessary. Um, I find that maybe simply because I have the luxury of doing this now because we are product reviewers and we do get sent entire lines. If I have the shampoo and the conditioner in the house for the line, I feel like I'm giving it a jump start on success. So I'm like, okay, so now that the shampoo and conditioner is out there on the market, why not use the whole collection? You know. Um, because obviously they make things to go with their lines and their stylers and all of that. So I figured I'd be one step ahead of the gang. So this morning I used the yeah. lavender scented. You like them, but you don't like jump out the window. I'm not jumping out the I, window. I jump out the window. Yeah, I, I love the curl mix shampoo and conditioner. Yeah. But I'm just a curl mix. But girl. I'm jumping out the window because my hair is short and we still are trying to. That's why I think maybe we are lost and don't have content out there as much as we could because we're trying to figure out our hairstyles and we're not trying to do a whole lot of stuff until we do figure it out, you know, because we're not trying to cause dryness and split ends and things that we're kind of not really accustomed to um, with the haircuts, you know, we're just trying to see what works best. Yeah. So we're not doing a whole lot of testing because every time we test, we're just putting products in and getting different results and we're not really sure what the look is going to be and so we're just yeah. being cautious right yeah and like i'm still getting used to my haircut and the bangs like, i feel like i haven't taken any like really cute selfies and like, i'm t i don't want to bust it like i want my hair to be cute and like testing can sometimes require your hair to look busted like no this yeah. didn't work out and so like i'm still trying to feel like cute with my haircut yeah and i don't want it to look crazy so, so. i think chroma is just a fabulous brand and fabulous products for what i want right now because my hair is short and curly and you know that just I try to get the simplest thing for Adam to do the other day when he did that video and I thought it would be very easy for him and it really was I gave him no direction because he doesn't receive directions well guys and so he doesn't like a whole lot of rules so I had to be like live and let live and I know that the brand specifies the moisturizer down and then the gel on top I know that you have tried the gel down and the moisturizer on top and it worked and Adam just did whatever he just was grabbing bottles. He didn't know because they're identical. They look identical. If you don't really look and see that one says moisture, one says gel, then, you know, so I don't think Adam cared. One was set, I think, on the counter in front of me and one was set on a chair that I always, like, put my leg on. on when he lines. even used product. When he even used product. I was like, where's product. the product? Yeah. <laughs> like, is he using product? Yeah, when he even used it. So the final result looked fabulous. And it's definitely what I go for, definitely what I'm looking for. Now, today I'm going to apply a little bit more. Or let me put it this way. Today I'm going to put some product in, okay? Because I loved what he came up with. I loved the results. But I have to say by the end of the night, it was just frizzing. And I was like, today, look at this. I'm like, for what? Like, I haven't, nothing happened. Mm -hmm. But I think for the camera and everything, it looked fabulous. But because he didn't put any product in, but barely, he just... Top, he put it on the top like it was topical like he just coated it I'm like what is this about so i'm gonna definitely try this again but for you guys that use curl mix which ones are your favorite and I, i'm definitely mixing them up today that's often been a question can you mix them so i'm definitely mixing them and so this one like i said speaks about moisture so that's good i'm putting the moisture in on this layer after i put the water in kind of like locking in that moisture now i like the softness and i 
there's a video that's going around that Chromex uses constantly. When we when their moisture, uh, the avocado moisturizers first came out, we did a video and they've taken a snippet of that video. And in the video, I'm saying it's so soft, it's so soft, it's so soft, you know. And so I'm like, when I saw that last night, I'm like, that's right. I was like saying it's so soft and I just liked that nice, eerie, blowy feeling. And the one I used in that video Sorry, was the there green go, one smaller. Mm -hmm. so right i know right or are we getting bigger <laughs> bigger probably that okay we went through pies again guys <laughs> this time it was a key lime and the hershey pie we actually shared this time with the boys we gave them each a slice <laughs> and then we ate the rest of the pies ourselves <laughs> mind you so much for florida in a week right so much for miami body ready <laughs> so much for that I mean, yeah, went out the window go out the summer with a bang go out go out the window with a bang yeah so I'm trying to see if I will get the softness that I want and the moisture that I want. All right. And we're so good because we got up early today. Yesterday we kind of just lounged. And today I have a doctor's appointment. Um, I, I go to my thyroid endocrinologist. So I'm going to the thyroid doctor today. And so we're up early. Figure out, we'll put out some content and style our hair. Oh, look at that. It looks so good. Yeah. So I'm, I'm liking the urban hydration on my side. Um, both products have great slip. This daily moisturizer was definitely thicker than this styling cream. I wasn't expecting that because I like gooped it out and that's why I just kind of put it in. But I'm being more um, intentional with the styling cream. But I like the way it feels. Oh, what, so you put what, the daily moisturizer, you said it kind of goes down like as a leave-in? Yeah, but it's okay. thick. I wasn't expecting it to be as thick as it was. I okay. was like, ooh, because I like pumped it out like a lot. So that's why I just kind of put it in okay. all over. You just put like how many, how did you just pour it in or? Yeah, I put like a in? clump in okay. and then I just went all over my oh, head, okay. but now I'm being yeah. more intentional with the styling cream. Okay. Um, if you guys, I don't know how long Urban Hydration has been around. I feel like it's been around for a while. They have a lot of different lines. They have a line, this is honey. They have Jamaican black castor oil. They have coconut oil. Um, their lines look, look pretty good. Shampoo, conditioner, mask, deep conditioners, gels, um, all natural products, curly girl friendly, black owned. Um, I always see Urban Hydration in um, TJ Maxx and Marshalls. That's yeah. where I see. So when I was in there the other day, I picked up one more product. The uh, the Honey Repair Oil. Wait, Honey Health and Repair Hair Oil. Okay. It smells so good. I was like, I want it. So, so we're, we're kind of like assuming. Um, but if, if anybody knows anything more about this, did they change the name kind of like Shea Moisture did? Where they went from the leave-in one time, it was like the growth you know, the, you know the one, the castor oil, all right, the leave-in one? Yeah. It used to be called something growth, and now it's called... Yeah, like growth, like uh, Jamaican black castor oil, like growth and repair, and now right. it's called like rest restore yes. or something. Like yeah, restore. they took the word growth out, they changed... Strengthen, oh, strengthen, grow, and restore. Now it's yes. just strengthen and restore, I think, Yeah, something, something like that. that. I don't know. It's on the shelf there somewhere. Growth no, is but... actually not on the shelf anymore. All right, it used to be. All right, we used to so... have a Shea Moisture okay, shelf, guys. and then we, we moved it out for... Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Alakay and Sotanicals. So it went from the shelf. Is it now into the in the box? It's, it's in the bin. The bin. It's the in, shell, the bin. Yeah, it's uh -oh. actually it's in the bin. It used to be like a huge Shea Moisture shelf, and then I didn't know where to put your Alakay and Sotanicals because it was overtaking. <laughs> uh huh. And so we had to uh, move it out, move Shea Moisture out. Okay. Let me see. All right. So, but anyway, so if anybody knows about that, out of curiosity, I'm kind of. Saying, did they change the yeah. name or did they? I don't know. You know how these brands do. Ooh. Like some things are sold in Ulta. And you can't get them anyplace else, and so maybe you have the one that. Yeah, well, I mean, when I, I went, know. when I went, when I googled, this did not come up. The health and repair did not come up at all. It's um growth and repair, and the growth and repair is on their website. Okay. So that's what they're offering. Those are the offerings for the honey. <laughs> Although I have the health and repair. All right, so I wonder if they changed the name or not. So if you guys know if they changed the name. All right. All right, gotta do the bangs. Mm -hmm. My hair looks so shiny and healthy. Wow. Um, I have high hopes. I think this is gonna be nice. It feels mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. Products had nice slip. They, it smells good. It's, it's honey and um, it's argan oil and sweet vanilla bean. So if you can imagine that, vanilla. Oh, really? Let me smell. Girl, like stick your nose in any of them. They smell really good. Oh, wow, yes. Let's see, hold on. Girl, you can't get it from sniffing it? I can't. Yeah, it smells really, really, really good. Girl. Right. I'm trying to think what it smells like. You know that smell, the original Jergens lotion smell? That's what it kind of smells like to me. 
still have now they come up with like every single different kind of smell but the original jergens there's nothing like that i think it's called i think over the years they kind of perfected like what they wanted to name it i think it's called like cherry almond or something now mm -hmm. to me it kind of smells like the original jergens smell um, from years ago. i just lifted up this brush this is my newest brush i'm obsessed with um you brought to my attention that every time i bring a new brush home it's I keep saying who like the same person who I keep getting it from. Yeah. So Lexi Marcella on here on on Instagram and on YouTube, she puts me on <laughs> to brushes. She's always talking about brushes. And so this is the latest brush she's been showing on her Instagram a lot. And so finally I like broke and got it because I'm like obsessed with brushes right now. And I love this. Um, this is a Philips Flex brush, although I think Curl Keeper sells them. And they call them like the curly brush, curly detangling brush or something like that. Curl Keeper sells them for like 20 something dollars. And I found this on house of beauty and i paid 12 dollars for it and that included shipping and everything so that's I will put, you i know because <laughs> i no, because she's always talking about that brush and i was like i'm not paying that 20 dollars for it even though yeah. i was getting ready to break and pay it because i really <laughs> want to try it yeah. and then i just like googled like curly flex brushes to see what would come up and house of beauty had it and i love okay. house of beauty so i was like sold 12 dollars. i'm buying mm -hmm. it okay. and um i love it so much. i love it more than the um this or that if i had to choose um, I love this more than most of the brush. The, the um, tangle teaser. The tangle teaser. Okay. I love this more than that. All right. Girl. All right. Oh, you're done, girl? I think I'm done. Oh, yeah, my hair looks so shiny and healthy. And it's, I hope I didn't put too much in because it's like very moisturized now. But I think it's going to dry cute. Okay. And it'll last me more than what Adam's busted wolf did. You moved along faster than I did. I did. Though. I know, like we are honorable, like we really got up early and did what we had to do. Okay. Well, I'm proud of us. I'm gonna be over here <laughs> fixing, finding your own business. Fixing my bangs. Mm -hmm. We're gonna let our hair no. air dry. I think we're actually gonna like really let it air dry. I think we're gonna really because you like could, go you out into we, the elements. It's been nice out. Yeah, we kind of underestimated ourselves and we didn't think that we would be ready in time so yeah. we thought that we have time now and then you're like well let's just sit in front of fans but i'm like no i mean not fans heaters but i don't want to sit in front of a heater yeah. i don't want your, that hot heat your appointment my is at one mm -hmm. and we woke up at 5 30 <laughs> to give ourselves time to like do everything and yeah. film the front half of this video and it's only 10 o'clock right now yeah so we did good we did very we did good. good okay yeah. all right so we are going to let our hair dry and we'll be back to show you guys these results okay all right see you guys soon. all right Bye. And we are back. These are our results. And they're mm -hmm. cute. We're like, oh, good. Just like a little makeshift day, just grabbing something and just getting on camera to chit chat. I'm so glad I grabbed the Urban Hydration because I've been wanting to try it. And I was just like, let me just do it. Say, um, I don't know what to expect. So but in your new um, hair cut arsenal? Yeah, because okay. I said I'm starting an arsenal of like products that I know give me good wash and goes with this mm -hmm. haircut. And right now I have three. This collection here, I would you definitely do again curl mix and the diva curl stretch cream um okay. those are on like a separate shelf like okay these definitely work for my haircut my bangs everything day okay. one um but i like it it there's hold a lot of curl definition um it's not dry i i really really like it yeah no i really like mine this is of course curl mix as you guys saw in the beginning of the video the two i put the, the um the lavender moisturizer underneath and i put the um what is it? The softening one, the lemon. Go where you put the cream. Go where you put, put on the shelf. No, I did not. I don't know where they're, they're over there on the shelf. Okay. I didn't know what curl mix products look like. <laughs> the, uh, it'll be in the thumbnail, right? Because by yeah, the time we start posting. Just... Why not, girl? Oh, should yeah. I just, okay. So the lemon cream on top as the gel. And I'm getting ready to top it off with the serum. The lemon cream. I'm also happy to see this. I forgot I had this one. I thought I only had the unscented and the, that watermelon one that you have, right? Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. We said we'd like... My hair doesn't really need it, but I want to try mm -hmm. the last product that I have here, the Honey uh, Health and Repair Hair mm -hmm. Oil, because it smells amazing, and I just want to put some in my hair. So it's super defined, and it has a lot of hold in it, so I think I probably would take it down a notch, because I'm still trying to test. This is what this day was all about, testing products to see what works for our new haircuts. So Adam put in too little. I thought it kind of um, got messed up quicker than it normally would have because he didn't put in enough as you guys saw in that video and i think i sectioned and put in it too much for the length of my hair so now i'll just have to fine tune it the next time just use less do probably more along like what i used to do is put it in my hand and kind of like just do one of these numbers not so much of the separating but not as freewheeling as adam did where he barely put anything in that was too light of a product okay so just a few little squirts of this just as we shine and some pizzazz. 
This oil smells good. Mm -hmm. This was three ninety nine. I remember this oil smell from last year. At TJ Maxx, it says promote health, strengthen hair, tame frizz, add shine, and it's four ounces for three ninety nine. Okay. So, but oh, that's right. I remember that night when you bought that. Okay. <laughs> But you can pick up this entire collection just like this on their website, and I believe it's fourteen ninety nine. I believe fourteen ninety nine. But okay. um, yeah, I can't wait to use it again. Especially, I might pick up a big the daily moisturizer and the style cream because basically, like I could go probably without the shampoo and really? conditioner. Even though if you want to buy the kit, totally do the whole thing. Great well, wash. We jump out the windows when we get like one good wash. Now we have to buy like the whole <laughs> thing. Like it's just an excuse <laughs> no, to buy something. I know. No, there's but I plenty would... there. Girl, there's not plenty here. Really? No. Okay. So what happened was they sent these products to us to like test and then do a video on. But we got this. We're like, there's no way we can have test days. Right. And then do a video this is not enough product so like you had to forego yours because i was like i want to try it you weren't really pressed no so i was like wasn't. i'm gonna jump in so now i've tested it and did a video on it like day one so basically this is the first impression but now i probably have like another maybe i could get like maybe two or three more wash days out of this yes. maybe that's probably but about all you'll have time to do i want to do this i want the styling cream and the daily moisturizer the from their website coming in they sell it separate things. yeah i know you're right i'm gonna go like buy it yes. and then like not even like really use it yes i'm already planning my summer series even though I probably won't call it summer because I'm going, because you know, last year we did this summer sotanical series mm -hmm. and that went way into the fall and the winter and we're still Still testing on, things. Right? So I'm not going to um, name, name it, it summer, but um, I'm excited about it. Yes, you started collecting, collecting products. <laughs> yeah, you were like, you just started doing it. I'm like, do it. So I know. We're going to be doing another whole like brand that's not really talked about and you're resurrecting them. I am, girl. From the graveyard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. But, yeah, so this so is a go. Very cute. Like this. Yes, like so, this. oops. So as I'm sitting here playing with it, I'm seeing that it's so defined and it has so much hold. So this definitely would last me three or four days. Um, and I'm going to definitely learn how to refresh. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah. it's not as easy as it was when my hair had some length to it. But I am going to master it. I don't think I ever mastered it, you know, because you guys asked me, did I master it when my hair was longer because of the length? And I was like, no, I don't think so. But yeah, I think. And then I kind of think. I said, yeah, I think it's a little bit easier. I think I started noticing that. So now I'm determined, now that I have experience, I think definitely I have to learn how to refresh this. Yeah. Taking a bottle and spritzing it, I don't know if that's going to work. Mm -hmm. But um, I still consider refreshing if I wet the whole head and just very sparingly apply the same product the next day. I think that'll work for me. But I don't think spraying at this point would work. Yeah. I think it'll freeze it more so than anything. But we do have, we are Curl Mix Ambassadors, so we do have a code for Curl Mix. It's mm -hmm. Mad Curls, and you can use it for 20% off, yeah. and it's unlimited, so you can use it as many times as you want. Yeah, we don't, that's... unfortunately, have any codes for Urban Hydration, no, nope. because we're not ambassadors there. But yeah. I would say try the Honey Line anyway, what? if you're in the market to try something new. Yeah, so how do you like the style of a video? It's, we said it's that too cream. we kind of like the laid back casual video where we could each pick something and just go for it. Yeah, because sometimes know? things don't need like a whole video. Right. I'm like, do we really need a whole video dedicated? to this i'm like maybe we can just each try like a different line in a video mm -hmm. and just you know talk meaning about the this, line meaning urban hydration we yeah so really for example i was it. like i don't know i'm like we don't have enough product here to be able to do a full video i'm like so let right. me just do it you do something else and they're still learning about urban hydration and they're still getting the info right you know but it's not like a full dedicated urban hydration yes. video at this moment and then on this side yeah. you're still learning and being educated about the chromix brand as far as like if you can mix and match the different gels and the moisturizers together you don't have to kind of like stick within like all the greens yeah. to go together and all like the that didn't need a whole nother curl mix video yeah it didn't no. need that so no. yeah, yeah so let us know we might know with the poster girls we might do that going forward have like two different brands in a video mm -hmm. and just like talk about the brands bring them to you most likely my brands will always be new because i'm just <laughs> always want to try something and yeah. i'm a creature of habit and i'm not bothered I do what I like. Because that will help us to move through these lines a little bit faster. Yes. Because um, there's yes. just a lot. There's a I was lot. like, this year, 2019 is going to be the year of saturation because um, brands are just dropping products left and left right. right. I can't center. wait to do what our end about? of the year video. What because is that about? Yeah. I feel like it's like not going to be like disappointing products. It's going to be like product flops. Mm -hmm. Like brands are just pumping them are out. Are you guys what? overwhelmed? I, I get overwhelmed. I get very excited when a brand that I love comes out with a product and it's like something, you know, it's like, um, what is it? Um, supply and demand. And so, but when you get a lot of supply and there's not that much demand and all of a sudden, you know, there's a whole brand new line and a whole, you know, it's just, I'm overwhelmed. Yeah. I'm overwhelmed. And it's com making them common. Yeah. My cousins always say, cuz don't be common. Like I can't be common. Okay. And so I just think brands that just keep pumping out, pumping out, pumping out, pumping out. They're becoming common. They're not yeah. exclusive anymore. And then to me, it's, yeah. I'm like, I'm feeling like it's like, um, 
quantity over quality. I'm like, there's no way all these products are quality because they're mm-hmm. all being pumped out. Same brand, same month, like that. Like, I don't know. Mm-hmm. In our opinion. In our, in our opinion. But who are we? I am HL. Who are we? Nobodies. Who are we? Just, <laughs> just little nobodies just stuck over here in this little corner. This just little natural curly little corner just over, over here. here. In the mm-hmm. macros corner. This is a wheat thing. Yeah. Um, so yeah, Urban Hydration, the mm-hmm. Honey line. This is called, the one I have is Honey Health and Repair, but on the website, it's Honey Growth and Repair. Same thing. Okay. Totally check it out. It's creams, no gels, but it acts like a gel. I would say this has a medium hold to it. Okay. This definitely has a medium hold. Oh, yeah. It's just, it it's just light. It's nice. It is light, but yet it has hold. It has hold. Wow, like... it's my hair, but long. Okay, it definitely feels like my hair, but long. You see how mine has that, like, oh, yeah. that hold? Yes, you feel it. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. feel like your hair, but, but it's short. Not, but it's not like a crunch. No. But you feel the hold. But there's a hold, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So it was yeah. a good wash day. It was a good um, wash day. This is Mad Curls merch. We have them in different colors. It's hashtag Mad Curls mm-hmm. fam. So if you're part of the Mad Curls fam, you haven't yep. got a Mad Curls fam shirt, then rip it off of you. No. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll send it to you. Mm-hmm. Yes. No, but they come in different colors, like pink, ombre. Yeah, ombre, I like the way kind of like ombre. ombre. It just fades to nothingness. Nothingness. So yeah, they're very cute. Okay. I love okay. this shirt. I love this shirt so much. I have to get more colors. <laughs> okay. All right. We're done talking here. Okay, okay, so thank you so much for watching this video and hanging out with us and today. And we shall see you in our next video. See you in our next video. All right. Bye. Bye.